Hey guys, well today uh, got a little treat. Steve and Steven. What's up? Stefano and Steven are number here. Number one, number two. That's my brother and that's my cousin Steve. Uh, yeah. They both came up. Uh, you know, every time my brother comes up, I end up working on his bike. It's not like we come up and have a good time and go riding. That's all I do. Good deal. <laughs> Well, yeah. today we're going to work on the, I need a new chain slider, uh, go and get one and we're going to replace it and uh, maybe tighten up the chain, gear oil, and uh, spark plug, spark plug, a little tune up. Maybe tune the bike a little bit, put some fresh gas in it, and uh, there, yeah, so pretty much uh, we're on our way to Royal Distributing and uh, See you guys in a bit. Another shot, slip my. What she got in the back door? Looking at me strange, but you know I don't care. Well, we finally got back three hours later. We got some spark plugs, some oil, some oil, some stroke oil, and chain, chain slider. Well, we got a new spark plug. Uh, got a chain slider. This is your chain slider. It's this rubber piece that comes goes along here and all the way through. The all the way through the front. His is broken. So we're gonna replace that. Uh, he's trying to get away all the time. Come here, buddy. Come on. Come on. Well, the easy part's done. Now, in order to remove the slider, we gotta remove the chain, we gotta remove this small sprocket, and then we can take the slider off. Runs all the way across and down the bottom. The chain actually slides on it, so it doesn't damage the aluminum. Now to get that bolt off, you gotta put the wheel on the ground and hold the brake, or otherwise it won't come off. Usually I wash it before I do this shit, but it's my brother's bike. <laughs> Yeah, one more at the bottom. We got one more over here. Point to this, not to me. Now here, you gotta remove these plastic, I mean these steel pieces, and put them in. Where's the other one go? This goes in here. Very simple shit. Don't forget the lock tight, or else these things will come loose. That's it. It's in place. Well, 
Now this bolt, you just snug it up because you're going to tighten it when the chain's back on or else you won't be able to tighten it. Well, chain's on, sprocket's on, slider's on. We're just going to tighten up the sprocket and uh, tighten up the chain, adjust the chain. I'm almost starting not to like this Geico Honda. Because <clears throat> everything we do is just a little more difficult than it should be. Bring it at the end of the driveway. trying to adjust this carburetor like I said everything on this bike is just a little bit harder I think might have to might have to overhaul the carburetor on this thing I think we're gonna end it here uh, we've been at it with this uh, Geico Honda for about four hours now you know I uh, got some things done to it uh, still can't get it the carburetor right uh, th yeah we might uh, have to change uh, the jets or maybe just go for a rebuilt carb I think the carburetor is getting a little bit old and uh, it's got a couple leaks here and there on that carburetor that carburetor ain't doing too good so uh, runs you know you can still take it out but it's not running crisp uh the way it should you know so uh i guess we'll say bye right here bye for now you say